We live, baby. All right, we're back for episode three. This is the camp shelves. We're going to veer off course a little bit today and, and do something for the holidays. We're going to do a, a cornbread episode. Everybody eats cornbread for with most of their meals. So we're going to do two different types of cornbread today. We're going to do a traditional and a Mexican type cornbread. And we have the boss ladies with us here today yep. to show us how to do it. We got Don and Vicky here, and, and Big Daddy said yours is a little dry. It's dry, and, and yeah. I don't even do cornbread. So. Well, I, I call myself the cornbread king, yeah. but I know I, I'm not there. Uh, and uh, at least you admit it. Man. Yeah, I, I like I like corrective uh, or or. Cr well, I showed you the right way. Right, and yeah. it, this is stuff that's going on now for the holiday season. So, right. making good corn cornbread is important for dresses. So, let's go. All right. All right. Donna's getting ready to get started with her traditional cornbread. What she's done, done, she took some Crisco. She done greased the pan. Now we're going to go from there. You, you want, we got to warm it in the oven, right? Correct. Yeah. Uh, I've done learned from her and Eugene. They told me that thing's got to be hot. And uh, when you put your cornbread in the pan, it needs to be sizzling. That way, you know you got it right then. We got the oven heating at what temperature? 425. 425. So we're gonna put it in the oven, get it hot, and while it's doing that, she's gonna mix up the cornbread. So here we go. All right. All right, how much cornmeal do you need? I don't measure, so it's about three cups. About three cups. Yeah. You want a little extra for yours. Yeah. All right. All right. What do you need next? I need a little flour. Flour. Just a little. Why do you put the flour in? It makes it more cake like. In other words, moist. <laughs> Where mine was dry. But I learned that I was mixing my cornbread the same consistency that I do hush puppies, and I done found out that's a no-no. One egg. Two and I put a little bit of sour cream. That sour cream really makes it more. Yes. Well, it, <laughs> two two big tablespoons. Yeah, and buttermilk. Real buttermilk. Real buttermilk. Whole buttermilk. Not none of that. Two percent. This is just butter she done warmed up. Stick of butter. Stick of butter. Ready to go in the oven. All right, now we gotta wait till that skillet gets hot and then we'll put it in. All right, we got the skillet hot. We fixed to put it in the cornbread in the skillet. That's what you gotta have. Wee. 
That's gonna be a big pawn. Uh -huh. All right, we're putting it back in the oven. And there we go. Need about 25 minutes. 25 minutes. All right, we're getting ready now. We're gonna pull this out and, and put it into the pan. And, uh, woo. Ooh, we. All right. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Yeah. You can't beat that. Just plain old traditional cornbread, Donna did, and you can use the same cornbread Maybe. for my dressing and everything else. Cornbread dressing. All right. So, I'm here with my boss lady today, and uh, I don't know anything about cornbread. She, she cooks it, I eat it. <laughs> That's just the way it is. So, I'll do whatever you tell me to do, or I get out of the way. Okay, you can help. Okay, we're gonna put, I don't measure a whole lot, but y'all don't either, do you? I'm gonna put some oil in the pan to let that be heating up. And I don't really measure. Just get the bottom good enough. Yeah, that'll do. Put that in the oven for me, in the put oven. Put it in the oven. And let it be heating up while we cook. All right. Okay, so I've got my special Mexican cornbread mixture. We start with the base, and like I said, I don't measure, I don't know exactly how much that is, but it'll be just enough. Okay, you can pour me a third of a cup of real whole buttermilk. Whole buttermilk. And I'm gonna, while he's doing that, I'm gonna put in one egg. Put a can of cream corn. I thought you'd come out to garden. Well, you don't know how to garden, so we had to go buy it at the store. We're gonna mix that up when you learn how to garden, and we'll have some fresh corn in ours. Well, you told me to come out to your mother's garden. My mother has a garden, but she doesn't cook, grow corn. Okay. okay, and then we're gonna add some cheese because cheese makes everything better. How much cheese you had? I don't measure. I'm gonna look at it. A Nobody little... measures on this show. So. <laughs> when you make it enough, you don't have to measure. A little bit over a cup, if I was really gonna measure, and I'm gonna look at that and see how I like that. I may put more, more is better. Um, sometimes when we make this, we put um, jalapenos in it. The, the people at my house don't like hot cornbread, so tonight, tonight we're gonna make it without the peppers. But you can do the, you can add the peppers if you want some heat. And this cornbread is going to be a thin, like I think Donna's is a traditional, it's gonna be a thicker, fluffier cornbread. This is gonna be thin and ooey gooey, because it's got the cheese in it. Okay, so all we've gotta do now is wait for our, just, just show, we'll show it, mixture. show our mixture. It's a yellow. We will make, wait for our oil to heat up. Heat up. And then we'll be ready All right. to pour it in the pan. Put my hand I'm going to um, get the pan out with our hot grease. And I'm going to pour some in there to acclimate our mixture. Okay, stir mm -hmm. it, stir it, stir it, stir it. Stir it. Uh -huh. stir, it stir it good. Okay, now. Is that good? That's good. Okay, I'm gonna put it in our pan, and then I'm gonna let you put the pan in the oven. And we're gonna cook it at 425 for about 25 minutes. We're gonna we're gonna check it at 20 minutes. See it sizzling? Okay, yep. it's ready. You can put it in the oven. All right. Now, I do it 
a certain way when I take it out. Um, because it has cream corn in it and cheese, it's not as um, firm as the cornbread that Donna made that was traditional, so you have to let it rest. And I let mine rest about five to 10 minutes. We're really gonna let it rest. You think you need help? I don't. I'm just gonna eat it. She's yeah. gonna flip it and I'm gonna eat it. He'll eat the whole pan by itself. Did you hear it? Did you hear it flip? I heard something. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Show it, Donald. Move this and let's put it beside Donald's. Okay. Bring them over here. There you go. We got traditional and Mexican right here. Traditional and Mexican, and we're waiting on Big Daddy to get here to to try it out. See what hey, he thinks. See what he thinks about it. Cool. We're cooking some turnip greens. Got turnips. On. We've got fried pork chops and chicken to go with it. We got turnips here. Oh yeah. All right, we'll, we'll be got. back. All right, Big Daddy finally showed up. We've got uh, fried chicken, fried pork chops, sausage, fried chicken legs, turnips, and cornbread. And Big Daddy is going to do the taste test, and you tell us which one you think you like. And I like the way you said that, Todd. This is going to be a taste test because mm -hmm. I don't want to judge two particular pounds of cornbread before we have all of them in the contest together. So I'm looking forward to right, this. Uh, Y'all kind of put me on the spot uh, with these Camp Chef videos. I didn't want to get in them. All I wanted to do was edit them. But when it comes to tasting good homemade cornbread, I volunteer. So <laughs> this is two. This is uh, Todd and Vicky's and Joe Allen and uh, Donna's. Correct. That's Isn't right. That right. We got two different styles. Down, huh? Two different styles. Uh, and one of my favorite is the is the Mexican cornbread, and I am a good. Uh, taste mm -hmm. tester on it, so. That's my favorite. I figured you was a traditional man, but you like the Mexican too. Very, very moist. Very, very flavorful. Mmm. I like that. That is very, very good. All right, I'm going to kind of wrench my mouth out a little bit. Now, the last time I tasted Joe Allen's cornbread. It was dry. Well, well just <laughs> when, when you brought me, you brought it to me when y'all cooked the, uh, what was it, the squirrels and dumplings? Yeah. Right. And the cornbread was very, very dry. And then you called Donna in and she corrected it. And she corrected, corrected me. It. So, all right, now, let me taste this. Let me, let me, let me rinse my mouth out of you. <laughs> Mm. So this is new, improved Joe Allen cornbread. <laughs> mm -hmm. Much better. Much, Much better. better. Yeah. Donna helped him out. Yeah. I would grade both of those a solid 10. Solid right 10. On the 10. That's what we want to hear. Let's eat. Shane's ready to go home. He's he about to start. <laughs> All right, let's eat. All right, let's eat.